Hey, Francis here from MTBR, and I'm going to talk about the smallest bike rack in the world called the Sea Sucker Hornet. And um, here it was, it's, it's a Sea Sucker Hornet, $189, and it's really ideal for short term duty when you're traveling, uh, you got to rent a car, and you want to put your bike on, on your on a car that's not yours but the it's not for all cars it's really just for hatchbacks suvs and vans you know um, uh, vehicles with with a, a, a back window like this because the bike's going to hang uh, this way uh, and it can't be put on the roof so the um, the concept behind the sea sucker bike rack is the suckers right here these I think they're a marine marine company and they've developed this these uh, uh, these sucker holders you know much like your your bathroom uh, fixtures to hang your um, your soap and whatnot and they have a pump so it's a little more it's a industrial strength it's got a pump so you could really build up pressure in there as opposed to just pressing it sucks air here and um, it holds 140 pounds each of pulling pressure. So it's, it's very strong as long as it has a suction. So the way to do it is you find the location where your handlebars are gonna be. You press on it. First you clean it, and that's important. Um, I did this once without cleaning the glass surface. The dust and all that will break the seal. After an hour, the thing fell off. That was no good. Um, and you will know when it's losing suction because some, some of this orange will show. Orange means there's not enough pressure in there and you have to uh, either pump it up or clean it and fix your seal. So I'm not really going to clean it right now, but I'm just going to place it, press a little bit of pressure and the sucking is really, the pumping is really what's going to press it down. So there, once it doesn't come up anymore, it means you're on. It means you got a um, pretty solid, and um, it should last for days, you know, uh, without showing any orange. Meaning, your suction, is, your seal is good. It lasts a long time. So let's put a bike on. So this system is really meant for one bike per car. So it's not the most versatile in the world. But as you can see over here, um, I can put one inside and um, I can put uh, another bike outside using this system and it works well. So you just mount it, you just rest, rest the bars on it like that, rest the seat on the back, close it. So these pins are special because they they have a fail safe, they have a lock. Lever was in the way there. And there, it's 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 done, ready to go, ready to hit the freeway. They subscribe they caution you to uh, not have more than a 45 pound bike, not go more than 75 miles an hour. And um, and that's it. It just the seat just rests here. So hopefully you don't have a, a very rough seat that I can very hard seat that I could scratch your car. It can lift if you hit a huge bump. If you do some jumps with your car, but so you don't want to do that. But it is solid. And what they do to give you an extra sense of security or security blanket is they give you a little cable here. Um, driven around in it, not a long trip, but just to get the feel for it, it's pretty secure. So nice, nice system. They have a lot more sophisticated systems, but this is just, and we'll get them, but this is just to get our feet wet on the sea sucker system. Um, the, uh, the advantage is the convenience, you know, it's, it's less than a few pounds for this rack system and, um, 
you know, easy to install. You can travel with it. Uh, for me, I, I go through a lot of cars, testing cars. So this is a perf this is perfect. But I probably need the, the two bike system. The disadvantage is only one bike system, um, and since it only works on SUVs and, and vans and hatchbacks, you can actually put the bike inside. So it's kind of a rare occurrence where you need one inside and one outside, or you have passengers, two people. So not quite dialed right there. The, um, the, um, the other disadvantage is, I would say, uh, theft. You know, when, when the system is out, uh, when you go for your ride, these things are just hanging out there by their lonesome and someone who is interested in your system can just take off with it. Of course, you can take it off, put it inside, but then you have to reinstall it, which is a pain in the neck. So, but it's, I like to see innovation, American company, all, all US materials, you know, something new that we haven't seen before. And it makes a, um, uh, it, it opens up a whole new world of rack systems. Thanks a lot.